everyone it's me Deepa and I think I need a little makeover I cannot remember the last time that I cut my hair I can't remember the last time that I colored my hair I feel like I need change yeah I feel like I need a little change so you know I'm taking you on this journey with me so I'm not sure what color that I want yet oh gosh now I feel like I like it now I feel like I want to keep it I think I want to cut it cut off all this I'm gonna cut off all this. Oh my god, I'm going short. <laughs> I'm going short, I'm going short. I don't know. <sighs> yeah, I feel like I need I need a little change. This lockdown this lockdown life has me feeling like I need something to lift my spirits up a little bit more. So I think I'm going to go darker. Um I'm gonna get rid of these lighter colours, which is really, really, really sad in the hairdresser world when you go light then you go dark and then when you feel to go light again it's like this huge process so you know this is a huge um decision but i've made up my mind i'm going to go darker and well here goes right so this is my before <laughs> so yeah sometimes change is good right change is good change is good we all need change sometimes and you know if you're feeling a little down and stuff it does make you feel better so i'm hoping this helps me too actually i'm not hoping i know it'll make me feel good so let's get straight into coloring this hair okay so first thing you're gonna do mix up that color what i did i'm mixing two colors <laughs> okay hopefully we'll see better now yeah so i use rusk so i'm gonna add my develop onto this I'm not going to go into the techn technicalities of, of this, of mixing color, okay? <laughs> so, I'm just going to mix this really, really, really well and I'll be right back. So, my color is all mixed up. So, next, I want to protect myself and my clothes, even though I am wearing um, home clothes. <laughs> I want to make sure that I don't damage my top because I like this top. So I'm gonna just put it into my straps like that. If you have a cape, you can put your cape on as well. I think I'm gonna put mine on because I don't want color all over me. I'm very clumsy, right? Very, very clumsy. So um, most likely, even though I'm wearing this cape and all of that, most likely I'm still going to get color everywhere. See you guys, I'm clumsy. <sighs> I'm tired already. Next, gloves. I don't know, the more I look at myself on this camera, I, the more I feel like keeping my hair color. But no, I'm not keeping it. We want change, right? So what I like to do, I like to color from my ends go up. Let's call it medium brown. It's a, it's a dark color, but it still has a little bit of a color in there. It's not black. So what would happen is it could actually, if I go onto my roots first, it can change the color on my roots. And if it changes the color on my root, my root could be lighter in color because the heat from my scalp would basically process the color faster. And that's why I go on my ends first. So as you go on your ends, it will start, that color will start to, um, as we say, take. <laughs> the color will start to take. And then, um, and then I will go on to my roots. I will color my roots um, on the last 10 minutes. Okay, so I want to show you guys where I reached, right? So you can see I stayed away at least um, maybe one and a half, two inches away from my roots. And now I'm going to wait. As it's a dark color, it's going to take really fast, right? So maybe in 10 minutes, my ends is going to get really dark. So I, won't, I would not be able to see all these little um, lighter colors here. And when I start seeing that color coming in, what I'm going to do is go onto my roots. So I'll be right back after 10 minutes. Okay, so it has been about 10 minutes and my hair looks pretty dark. Oh my god. No turning back now, guys. So now I'm going to go onto my roots. Well, my roots is already dark and it's grown out a lot, like all the way there. So I can't remember the last time I colored, to be honest. I think the last time I colored, I did a video as well. So I'll have to check back that date when it was posted. So now I'm going to add it to my roots. So now this is a dark color, so be careful how close to your hairline you go because it will stain so what i do is take the brush and gently slide it like this on my hairline right around 
just take your time and do it don't take it and just dab it everywhere because you're going to get color all over your hairline and yeah, I have a lot of baby hairs pick it up in your brush and just kind of sweep it back like that so that is how I do my hairline um, I also take the tail of my brush and you can make a part down the middle like this part it so you can see everywhere here does not have color and then I go on to my root and just color my roots and I'm going to keep doing this all the way down all the way across and all the way back as well so yeah I'm going to continue doing that and I'll be right back again okay the recorder just came back on <laughs> uh, the features on this really something <laughs> came on again <laughs> I swear I'm not even pressing record. I'm just trying to do this so quickly. And I keep taking off the um the record button, but it insists that I should film this part. Hello. <laughs> so this is not gonna take very long now. I'll say ten minutes. Then I am going to wash. And then I'm going to show you my wonderful product because that's what I'm going to put in my hair next to show you guys how it works and how wonderful it will make your hair feel and scalp and energy because it is an amazing product. The ingredients that is in it is really, really good for your mental health, your mind, your head. I'll explain all of that. Yeah, I know. A hair product doing all that yeah it does it's amazing so it is this beautiful product that have so much positive energy in it is amazing it's remarkable so I can't wait to share it with you guys when I come back I'll be all washed up and yeah I'll show you what my new hair looks like and okay, so I am well. back let me take this clip off and my hair is totally black what did I do what did I do? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I love it. I It's what I wanted. So I'm very, very happy. And now we're going to cut. So I'm going to cut off at least this much. Um, so it looks a little bit different. And, you know, those little stringy ends would... I'll get rid of it. So new cut, new color. I feel brand new already. All right. It just starts recording on its own. I, I swear I wasn't even ready yet. Anyway. So how I'm going to cut, I'm going to make a middle part here. Yeah. My hair is very curly, okay guys, so I don't have to really stress on how, um, how perfectly straight my cut, my cut is, but okay, now I feel really sad to cut it, but it's going down, it's going down. I'm going to cut all of this out. Oh my god. Okay, no, I think I changed my mind. Hold on, I need, I need, I need two minutes. Okay, I made up my mind. I am going to cut it. So I'm going to use this line right here. Um, as I say, my hair is very curly, so it doesn't really matter to me how even this cut is. So please don't try this at home. <laughs> so I'm going to pull it really nice and snug. And you want to don't don't cut above your finger. Cut below. So once you have a nice grip. like that then you want to just cut right below your fingers so nice grip oh my god i'm cutting a good bit i look it's all the way down here so that's a lot that's about at least five inches so i'm just going in and i'm going to just cut oh, oh my god oh my god okay so i'm going again too late now right no turning back now oh my god so i'm going to hold it really nice and snug and i'm gonna cut right below my fingers don't try this at home guys this is not a good way to cut your hair really really not not a good way to cut your hair at all it would not it probably would not be even don't do it 
but I wear my hair curly most times, so it doesn't matter to me. I'm fine. Okay, I'm happy. This is this is a happy face. Be happy, Deepa. Be happy. Okay, I'm happy. I'm really happy. So I'm just going to run it through just to make sure it's okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm leaving it leaving it straight. Oh, I'm leaving it straight. Oh my god. I can't even function. I am doing what you call a blunt cut. So I don't care if any layers or anything like that. I just want it blunt. Okay, at this point, you can come forward like this. I'm not going to cut a lot off the front, just a tiny little bit. Okay. I'm happy with this. I don't care for too much layers right now. But, oh my god. I have not had short hair in a very long time. Oh my god. Alright. So, for the other part, I am going to now add um, my very new product. So, my first product from Sacred Tree was called the Neem. Okay, so this would have been my first product. It is Neem. Um, and my second product would be Brahmi. And now I'm going to just give you an idea on how to use it. So again, made easy for you guys. I just love my little pouch. I just love looking at it. Anyway, so made easy. It's in a spray bottle and it's a leave-in hair mask. So you just spray it on and I left my hair wet. I just washed it and I'm just going to mist it on my hair. So you don't have to... Oh, it smells so good. So you don't have to like um, spray a lot of it. So you can just lightly spray your roots like this, move your hair around, like massage some of that really good energy cleansing, <laughs> crown chakra cleansing product on your scalp. Just gently massage and if you have curly hair, you can scrunch it up like this and just leave it to dry naturally and I swear your curls is going to be amazing. Um, if it dries naturally or you can just go ahead and style um it's pretty late so i'm going to just head straight into it so and I style my up. hair i love the way my hair looks and feels i don't want to touch it too much i have not styled my hair in so long so i'm so excited about it and i'm excited about my new hair cut too my new hair color my new hair cut so lockdown has us oh my god it's so frustrating i mean why would you style your hair anyway you know you can't go anywhere i hope this is this will be over soon and i hope you guys are safe um stay healthy do your steam inhalations and try making your immunity boosting tea as much as you can and stay safe exercise stay healthy so until next time uh bye guys <laughs>